Today we'll be doing the following the integral. And to do this integral, we'll let x equal to the secant of theta. So that means that dx, the derivative of secant, is secant theta tangent theta d theta. And the square root of x squared minus 1 is equal to the square root of secant squared theta minus 1, which is equal to the square root of tangent squared theta is equal to tangent of theta. So this is equal to the integral of 1 over secant theta times tangent theta. And dx, we said, is secant theta times tangent theta d theta. And as you can see, the entire fraction goes away. We have the integral of d theta, which is theta plus a constant. But as you recall, we said that x equals the secant of theta, which implies that arc secant of x is equal to theta. So therefore, the integral of 1 over x times the square root of x squared minus 1 dx is equal to the arc secant of x plus a constant. And this is the final answer. Thank you for watching.